Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I would like to speak to you about a very recent study concerning vegans. With the rise of ethical and environmental awareness, veganism has become a popular dietary choice for many. People embrace vegan diets not only for animal welfare reasons, but also for the potential health benefits. However, while veganism can offer various advantages, it is essential to recognize that this diet has its own challenges and potential dangers. In this video, I will speak about some of these potential hazards associated with following a vegan lifestyle, shedding light on crucial nutritional aspects and addressing other significant concerns. As we all are aware, a vegan diet is entirely plant-based and excludes all animal products including meat, dairy, and eggs. The motivation behind adopting a vegan lifestyle often includes reducing one's ecological footprint, promoting animal rights, and seeking improved health. While many vegans thrive on this diet, it's vital to consider the potential risks involved. For example, one of the primary concerns when it comes to vegan diets is the risk of nutritional deficiencies. Since animal products are the most common sources of certain essential nutrients, vegans must pay close attention to their diet to avoid potential health issues. This recent 2023 study discusses these potential dangers, so let's, let's take a look at them, let's examine them. The first one is vitamin B12 deficiencies, which is well known in the vegan world. If you're following a plant-based diet, you might be missing out on vitamin B12. This essential vitamin produces red blood cells, keeps your nerves healthy, and supports DNA synthesis. Unfortunately, plant-based diets don't naturally provide enough vitamin B12, as it's mainly found in animal products like dairy, eggs, and meats. Some plant-based foods contain inactive forms of vitamin B12, which may not be as reliable as fortified sources. For example, fermented soy products, shiitake mushrooms, algae, and unfortified nutritional yeast are not considered reliable sources of active vitamin B12. Low levels of vitamin B12 can lead to various health issues affecting your mood, memory, energy, and nerve function. In severe cases, it can even cause irreversible neurocognitive problems. The second one is iron and zinc deficiencies. Iron is vital for oxygen transport in the body, while zinc supports the immune system and helps with wound healing. Plant-based iron sources include lentils, spinach, and tofu, but they may not be as readily absorbed as animal-based iron. Zinc is found in nuts, seeds, and legumes, but phytates in these foods can hinder absorption. Vegans should consider focusing on consuming adequate amounts of these minerals and consider pairing them with vitamin C rich foods to enhance their absorption. The next one is omega-3 fatty acids imbalance. Omega-3 fatty acids play a vital role in the brain health and in reducing inflammation. While fish is a common source of omega-3s, vegans can get them from flax seeds, chia seeds, and walnuts. However, the conversion of these plant-based sources into the most beneficial form of omega-3s like EPA and DHA is inefficient in the body. Vegans may consider algae-based supplements to ensure an adequate intake of these essential fats. The next one is calcium deficiency. Calcium is essential for strong bones and teeth and is commonly associated with dairy products. Vegans can obtain calcium from fortified plant-based milk, tofu, kale, and broccoli. Adequate calcium intake is crucial for vegans, especially those at risk for osteoporosis and bone related issues. The next one is vitamin D deficiency. Another concern related to vegans is its potential for this vitamin B deficiency. Vitamin D is essential for bone health, immune function, and overall well-being. While our bodies can produce vitamin D when exposed to sunlight, individuals living in regions with limited sunlight or those who spend little time outdoors may be a serious risk. Unlike some other essential nutrients, vitamin D is not naturally abundant in plant-based foods. Fortified foods like certain plant-based milk and cereals can provide some vitamin D, but it may not be sufficient to meet daily requirements. Vegans should also consider incorporating other sources of vitamin D into their diet, such as fortified supplements or spending more time outdoors in the sunlight. Regular monitoring of vitamin D levels and consulting a healthcare professionals can help vegans ensure they are meeting their nutritional needs and maintaining optimal health. The next one is protein deficiency. This is well known in the vegan world also. Proteins are building blocks of our body. 
responsible for various functions including muscle repair and immune system support. Vegans can obtain sufficient protein through sources like legumes, tofu, tempeh, nuts, and seeds. However, lacking protein can lead to muscle loss, fatigue, and impaired immune function. To mitigate this risk, vegans should play, plan their meals carefully and continue different protein sources. You must combine them to get the right amount. And the seventh deficiency is being deficient in three essential nutrients. Okay, vegans may face potential deficiencies in three conditionally essential nutrients, nutrients commonly found in the omnivore diet, creatine, carnitine, and taurine. These nutrients are usually produced by the body in sufficient amounts under normal conditions. But when somebody is restricted to eating just a vegan diet, it can disrupt their production, leading to various medical conditions. Okay, let's start with creatine. Creatine is a vital energy source for muscles and the brain, and it plays a crucial role in meeting sudden spikes in energy demands. Plant-based diets lack creatine, which is found abundantly in animal products. Some supplementation may be necessary, especially for those with some kind of genetic impairments in creatine production. Studies have shown that creatine supplementation can improve memory, cognitive function, and muscular strength in vegetarian and vegan athletes. The next one is carnitine. Carnitine is essential for mitochondrial function and cellular energy production. Pregnant women and those under increased physical stress, like dialysis patients, may be at risk for hypocarnitemia. Carnitine helps transport long chain fatty acids into the mitochondria for energy production, making it crucial for heart and muscle function. It also has anti inflammatory and antioxidant properties. It plays a role in insulin sensitivity. Deficiencies in carnitine can lead to fatigue, liver issues, and impaired fatty acid oxidation. Last one is taurine. Taurine is critical for high energy tissue such as the brain, retina, and muscles. Unfortunately, plant-based diets do not provide taurine, leading to lower levels in vegans compared to omnivores. Taurine is essential for neurological development, antioxidant protection in the eyes, and various bodily functions like bowel flow, blood pressure regulation, and detoxification. Inadequate taurine intake or production can lead to a range of health issues including cardiomyopathy, vision disorders, and hormonal imbalances. To ensure optimal health, vegans should consider incorporating suitable supplements or fortified foods that provide these essential nutrients and consult with a healthcare professional if needed. By addressing these potential deficiencies, individuals can thrive on a vegan diet while safeguarding their overall well-being. In conclusion, embracing a vegan lifestyle can be a positive, meaningful choice, aligning with personal values and contributing to a sustainable planet. However, like any diet, veganism comes with its challenges. Individuals can adopt this lifestyle safely and responsibly by understanding and addressing the potential dangers of a vegan diet. Prioritizing balanced nutrition, staying informed, and seeking professional advice when needed will help vegans enjoy the benefits of their dietary choice without compromising their health. Me personally, I am not a vegan. I have no plans of being a vegan. But people, people that eat a vegan diet should pay careful attention to these deficiencies that I described in, from this new study. So... Maybe this information helps you. Maybe you are already aware of it, but if you're not, I hope this information helps if you are vegan. Have a wonderful day. See you again in my next video.